Hello everyone, my name is Marciano. I'm a CCNA, CCNP, and I have specialized myself on the SD1. On this video, as you can see, I'll be doing a configuration of design configuration on the SD1. So this is pretty much the design I'm gonna do on GNS3. As you can see, I got the SD1 controllers on this side as I name it Sheffield Headquarter. I have a router here that I changed the item here. And uh, what I'm going to do is for this video not to be too long, I'm going to add all these devices on my GNS3, but I will not connect them all. I'm going to just line them up as it shows here but on the new design i will change a little bit so as you can see that every single side i only have one device so what i'm gonna do to have redundancy i'm gonna have two vages on rwanda two vages in lisbon two vages on paris and two cages in barcelona all to make equal as we have four so i'm gonna have two VHs, two VHs, two CHs, and two CHs in total of four for each. And instead, I have a router here. I'm gonna have a switch, and on this switch, I'm gonna configure some VLANs, and I will be um, I will have a trunk with the CH and the VH. And I'm gonna have access um, VLAN on this side connected to the end device. I'm gonna have some computers here just to make a little bit more realistic as some companies have them configured. So I'm gonna pause the video and I will be back once all those devices are on. So I will just put those up to these devices here and I'm gonna leave the switches for the last, okay? Hello everyone, I'm back. As you can see on the screen here on my GNS3, I have the devices already on the topology. What I'm telling you to do is to have my videos, my serial videos, maximum 10 minutes each. But if I can do less, I will do it. So I'm gonna just show you two, two things for example. This switch is here. I'm going to be changing them. So as you can see, it take a little bit to load. So I'm going to do on the next one, I'm going to stop when it's load and I'll resume the video once it's load 100%. Okay. So I'm going to put a blue ones. That's it. So this one, I'm gonna change as well. Yep, I will change for red color, this one here. And MPL is gonna be green. This one is going to be the internet, internet cloud, I, so I'm going to do now, so I've got the symbols. This one as well. This one's gonna be my outbound management. So I'm gonna use to access the V manage, okay? Just 
duplicate this. Have this here, pretty much. Okay, so I have one more device, and this device is my Linux box. So what I did, I went to my VM, now, and I added my Linux, okay? So already here, I changed the name to root CA, because it's gonna act my, as a my root CA. I already have it here. And I'm gonna place it here. Because the image is too small, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just add and I'm gonna add this one here so after I put all the cables and everything I'm gonna put this one on the top and I'm gonna do I think it's a lower three times no it's raise that's it so this box is gonna be on the back of it it's gonna be like this so it's a little bit bigger and you can see better okay so I'm gonna just move this one here so on the next video I'm gonna have all all the links all them linked and uh, one more thing almost almost eight minutes okay on this cloud here I'm gonna give if you wanna see more interface you have to click here show special Ethernet interfaces and I'm gonna give the VMnet 8 that's my NAT it's the same IP subnet of my GNS3 um VM and when I get you 0 slash 24 as an example okay so I'm gonna connect this one first here and that's it so I'm gonna put this here and uh, this is done okay this is all for this video and the next one I will have pretty much all connected and I hope you enjoyed this serial videos thank you so much